hello everyone so this is our set of the day it says a leading magazine conducted a survey of the four b schools s1 s2 s3 s4 and uh, based on different four different parameters parameters are p1 p2 p3 p4 in the survey they awarded some points to the b schools on different parameters some of the points distributed to all the b schools in the parameter is equal for all the different parameters it's, it it means this line means sum of the points distributed to all the b schools in a parameter is equal for all the parameters it simply means that the total of points awarded in the parameter p is same as the total of the points awarded in the parameter p2 similarly p3 and p4 they have the same points now in every parameter points got by the four b schools they form four different ap's and in any one of the four parameters b school getting the highest point is ranked 1 and getting the lowest is ranked 4 right kisi bhi ek parameter mein jis b school ka highest points hai that will be ranked number 1 and the one who is getting the lowest points is ranked number 4 right so it is known that in any parameter all the b schools were awarded distinct points so kisi bhi parameter ke andar jo b schools ko points award kiye the they were all distinct राइट मीन अगर पी वन की बात करूं देन वी हैव फोर डिफरेंट स्कूल्स वन विल बी रैंक वन सेकेंड विल बी रैंक टू रैंक थ्री एंड फोर एंड द पॉइंट्स अवार्डेड विल बी डिफरेंट हेयर ए पॉइंट्स ए पॉइंट्स अवार्डेड हेयर विल बी बी सी एंड डी बट वन थिंग इज क्लियर इन एवरी पैरामीटर पॉइंट्स गॉट बाय द फोर बी स्कूल शुड फॉर्म अ ए पी सो दिस ए बी सी डी दे आर इन ए पी एस थ्री वॉज अवार्डेड ट्वेंटी पॉइंट्स इन द पैरामीटर वन and its rank is 3 in this parameter right and points awarded to any b school in any of the four parameters is a non negative integer that means negative points cannot be awarded now first question says what could be the minimum total number of points got by b second says what could be the maximum points got by the b school first says minimum points got by b school second says maximum points got by a b school now let us try this set so the only valid information where i can fill in the points is about the parameter p1 right in which s3 college s3 was awarded 20 points and it was ranked 3 in this parameter so i have made a table in which parameter p1 p2 p3 p4 are given and rank 1 rank 2 rank 3 rank 4 are given right if you look at the questions nowhere in the question it is asked Uh, which college got the first rank, second rank? Nothing is given there, but but only the uh, question is asking for the ranks of the colleges, not which college got which rank. Right? It's already given that as per got the rank number four. So again, uh, question number uh, three is also asking for the uh, rank only. Right? So that's why in the table I have just made the parameters P one, P two, P three, P four, and rank one, two, three, and four. the second point says it says that s3 was awarded 20 points in p1 right s3 was awarded 20 points in p1 and its rank is 3 right so this rank is 3 in this parameter now this is the only information given to us right but if we look at the questions the first question says what could be the minimum total number of points got by a b school second says what could be the maximum number of points got by a b school right so let us now try to make the cases this is rank 1 rank 2 rank 3 and rank 4 now this uh college got the uh, third rank or i should say that rank 3 got 20 points in the parameter 1 it got only 20 points in parameter 1 right and since it is given that this is very important point it is given that in any one of the four parameters b school uh, sorry uh, this one uh, in every parameter points got by the four b schools form four different aps that means whatever the points are here they are in arithmetic progression right so one uh, i am just talking about the parameter number 1 if i have to meet the ap obviously rank 4 college should get points lesser than 20 so at max it can get 19 points so here a difference is of 1 so in order to get the 
arithmetic regression it should be 19 20 21 and 22 right now in this case uh, the lowest ranked college got 19 points right the second case could be again i am making the cases for p1 only second case could be that this is 20 this is 18 difference is of 2 this would be 22 and 24 this is again a possible case again third case possible is this 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 uh, college got 20 rank uh, 20 points this got uh, got 17 difference is of 3 so 23 and 26 so these are the possible cases right now first question is asking for the first question is asking for the minimum total points got by the b school right so minimum means the minimum of rank 4 we have to minimize these scores okay that means minimum can be on, can be only for the rank number 4 so that means i have to minimize these scores score of the rank number 4 uh, should be minimum okay now if i add up the values here if i add these values 20 21 20, uh, 22 21 20 and 19 i can see that their average is since they are in ap the average is the average of these two middle terms which is 20.5 so its score would be 20.5 into 4 or 82 its total is 82 similarly here the average is 21 so total would be 84 and here uh, average is 22 uh, 21.5 so uh, total would be 86 so i can see that as i am decreasing the scores of rank 4 the total is keep on increasing the total is increasing right and since the first question is asking for the minimum total number of uh, points got by a b school this is the first question that means i have to minimize the rank 4 uh, uh, i have to minimize the score of the rank number 4 so minimum that a college can get is zero it cannot get negative numbers right so if it is getting zero this will be 20 not here difference is of 20 that means since it is an ap it should be 40 and it should be 60 so this is the total score this is the maximum score that a college can get uh, 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 sorry that a parameter can get right i am just again uh, taking the case of p1 so this is a total score that a parameter can get at max and its total is 120 right which is just the average of these two numbers since the numbers are in ap right and next question is asking for the maximum total points got by a b school right maximum points so maximum would be for the rank number 1 and in order to get the maximum if i want this point number maximum this number as maximum this number as maximum that means i need maximum score in total for every parameter if i want to maximize this score the total score of parameter 1 should be maximum if i want to maximize the score of uh, rank 1 in parameter 2 i need the maximum score possible for parameter 2 right so i need the maximum scores and maximum that can be uh, got is 60 plus 40 plus 20 means 120 that means the total score for every parameter should be 120 right 120 should be for parameter 1 120 should be for parameter 2 120 should be for parameter 3 and 120 should be for parameter 4 and that happens if we go with this case 60 40 20 and 0 right so this is the first case so that means i need 120 score here 120 here and why i am writing a same score because it was given in the information itself that uh sum of the points distributed to all the b schools in a parameter is equal for all the parameters that means the points which were awarded in parameter 1 were same as the total points of p2 as the total points of p3 so if p1 has 120 points and we got this number because we had this number as 20 this has 0 this has 40 and this has 60 right so that means in every other parameter the sum would be 120 right now first question says what will be the minimum score what will be the minimum score uh, of the of a b school and that minimum could be from the rank number 4 right so that means i need to minimize this score i need to minimize this score okay <clears throat> now here i have 20 i cannot increase this value as 21 can i yes right 
uh, if I let us take this other case, if I take this number to be let, let's say 19, if I take this number as 19, say, if this number is 19, since these two numbers have a total of 60, the total is 120. So average is 120 by 4 means average is 30 for every num every uh, parameter. So that that simply means that these two numbers should be the rank number two and rank number three should be having the average of uh, 30. That means their total should be uh, how much 60, right? So if I take this number to be 19, in order to make the total 60, it should be 41. Now, if I take this these numbers 19 and 41, their difference comes out to be 22, right? Their difference comes out to be 22. So that means the AP should be with a difference of 22. So if I subtract 22 from 19, it would be minus 3. But this is not possible. Negative score is not possible. So that simply means that 19 is not possible here. I cannot take this value to be 19. So this value has to be more than that. So it is 21. Let us take this to be 21. So in order to make this, this score as 60, since the average is 30, average of all the numbers is 30. That means average of these two numbers is 30. So their total should be 60. That means the middle two numbers rank 2, rank 3, they should have a total of 60. That means this has to be how much? 39. Now here the difference is 18. So it should be 3 and it should be 57. Next, it could be 22. Now if I take this number to be 22, then it should be 38. So difference is 16 and it should be 6 now and it should be 38 plus 16, 54. Next, it could be 23. And in that case, it is 37, right? It is 37 and this is 51 since difference is 16. So it has to be, uh, sorry, difference is 14. It has to be nine. <clears throat> okay, in this way, we got the minimum points for rank number four and maximum that can be obtained for the rank number one. The first question says, what would be the minimum total points, uh, number of points got by B school? Minimum would be the sum of these numbers, 9 plus 6 plus 3, which is 18. So answer to the first question is 18. <coughs> Second says, what could be the maximum total number of points got by a B school? So <coughs> maximum would be the sum of all these numbers. It is possible that, let's say this is quality number S1, which got 60 points uh, in parameter 1, 57 in parameter 2, 54 in parameter 3, and 51 in the parameter 4. Now, in this way, it will get the maximum scores. And maximum is just the sum of all these numbers. It is 222, right? So its answer is 222. I think uh, this is clear. The first two questions are clear to all of you. Now, come to the second, uh, third question now. The third one says, if S4 got rank 4 in all the four parameters. Now, rank 4 is for college number 4, right? Then the total points awarded to S4 in all the four parameters put together cannot be more than. Now, in this question, answer would not be 18, right? This is not the answer. Because in the first question, question was asking for the minimum number of points uh, that a B school can get. So we, what we did, we minimized this column, right? We minimized the points of this column. But now it says, S4 got the rank number 4, right? So total points awarded to S4 cannot be more than. That means we have to check how many points can be awarded to S4 at max. We need to maximize the values of this column. We can say that we have to find a value which is maximum for this column. We have to value which is maximum for this column. S4 ki value maximum dekhna hai right ki isse zyada value nahi ho sakti isse kam hogi right isse value zyada nahi ho sakti isse kam hogi total points of s4 put together cannot be more than that means we have to find the maximum points that can be given to this column right so answer would not be 18 right so answer would be either second third or fourth option that means in this case now i have to uh, what i have to do is i have to maximize this column okay I have to maximize this the value of this column. Now you can easily see that in order to maximize, if I take this number, let's say to 24, right? And it has to be 36. Again, I am taking the total to be uh, 120. The only reason is that I am maximize this column. 
Now, if I need to maximize this column, I again need the maximum points that can be awarded to a parameter, and maximum can be awarded as 120. Okay, so <clears throat> since I am maximizing this column, so to maximize this column, I need the maximum score, which is 120, right? And if I take this value, let's say 24, if I erase this part just to make it more clear, let us say this has 24 value, right? So in order to get the sum of these two numbers as 60, it should be 36. So difference would be of how much? 12. So that means it is 48 and it is 12. That means when I am increasing this value, this number is increasing, right? If, if I increase the uh, rank of uh, value of the rank number 3, the rank uh, value of the rank number 4 is also increasing, right? If I take this to be 25, it has to be 35, difference is of 10, it will be 45, it will be 15. So that means if the rank number value of rank number 3 is increasing, the value of the corresponding rank number 4 is also increasing. Right. So this is the logic. Now for that, what I'm now doing is, this is the rank uh, S4, college S4. This will, the, this will be the same, 60, 40, 20, and 0, right? And I need, I now know that if I increase the value of the rank number 3, the value of rank number 4 will automatically increase. Okay, so what could be the maximum value? Since rank number 3 has to be lesser value than the rank number 2, right? That means the maximum it can, and their sum is 60. That means it, first of all, it cannot be 30, 30. This is not possible. Okay, it cannot be 30, 30. So it would be at max 29. So if this is 29, this has to be 31. So difference is of 12. So this will be, oh sorry, difference is of 2. My mistake, difference is of 2. So this will be 33 and this would be 27, right? And if I take this value to be, let's say 28, so this has to be 32, difference is of 4. So it should be 36 and it should be 24. Next, if it is 27, it has to be 33, difference is of 6, so it will be 39 and it will be 21, difference is of 6, right? So these are the values which this uh, column can get at max. These, these are the maximum values that can be given to rank number 4. If you add up all these values, you will get some as 72. So that means the maximum value that can be given to rank number 4 is 72. That means option number 3. I think this question is again clear to all of you. Next. The next question says, if the sum of the points distributed to all the business schools in a parameter is minimum possible, right? Remember that this, this score was 20. Right. Now it says that if the sum of points distributed to all the B schools in a parameter is minimum possible, then the total points got by a B school in all the parameters is A. What could be the maximum value of A? What could be the maximum value of the uh, score in all the parameters for a particular business school? Right. Now the question says sum of points distributed to all the B schools in a parameter is a minimum possible. In the first three questions, we found we took the case when the points were the maximum possible. That means 120 here, 120 here, and 120 in all the other two, right? But now it should not be more. Uh, it should not be on the maximum side. It should be on the minimum side. And we already discussed that minimum would be when this is 20, this is 19, this is 21, and this is 22, right? This would be the minimum score. And in this case, the average is 20.5. Sum is 82. If you add up all these values, the sum would be 82. So 82 would be the points, uh, 82 would be the total points given to any parameter on the minimum side, right? And 82 by 4 average is 20.5. That means the average of these two values has to be 20.5 and uh, their sum should be 41. Their sum should be 41, right? Now, <clears throat> I need to maximize this score because question says total points got by B school in, a, in all the parameters A and we have to find the maximum value of A. So we, I need to maximize this number. 
I need to maximize this column, right? So <clears throat> now I have to see what values can be given to the other columns, right? Uh, just take the random values, right? Some of these two uh, ranks, rank number two and rank number three should be 41. Some of these two ranks should be 41. So if this number, if I take this number to let's say 10, this value has to be 31. Some of these two values has to be 41. So if this value is 10, this has to be 31. Difference is of 21. So, so since this is, this is an AP, if here the difference is 21, the next difference should also be 21. So this value will become minus 11, which is negative. This is not possible. Similarly, you can see that if 10 is not possible, you can check that 11, 12, 13 is also not possible. So if you take this, this number to be 13, let's say, then uh, in order to make this 41, you need to need 28 here, right? And in that case also difference is 15. So 13 minus 15 will be minus two, again, not possible. So what I can write here is I can write 14 here, right? So minimum value that this column can get is 14. And why I'm taking the minimum value? Because I need to maximize this value. I need to maximize this value. And since the total is constant 82, the sum of all these parameters, uh, sorry, sum of all these uh, ranks is constant, which is 82. That means if I have to maximize this number, I have to minimize the others, right? So the minimum value that this point can get is, this rank can get is 14. Now, if this is 14 and the sum needs to be 41, that means uh, it should be 27. And difference is 13. So here difference should, here the number should be 1. And in this case, the next number should be 40. Next, it could be 15. And it could be 26. Some will sum is 41. Difference is of 11. So this is 37. And this is 4. Next, we have 16. So if this is 16, this, this should be 25. Difference is of 9, so it has to be 34 and it has to be 7, right? So this is a, these are the maximum scores that can be given to a, a B school on the maximum side. And question is asking for their sum. So sum is 7 plus 2, 9 plus 4, 13. 1 plus 2, 3, 4, 7 and 6, 13. So answer is 133. Answer is option number 4. So this was all about this set. I think you got the idea how to solve this one. Thank you to all of you.